you know, Christy keeps saying to me, wow, well, you know, you have all these gigs. I do like spend, I spend half my year on the road. And she goes, why? Well, I wish I had all those gigs you have. And, and I said, well, you have a very important job. You have to sit home and, and get your royalty check out of it. <laughs> <laughs> I really wish that was my job. I Bob said, you have a house now. Yeah, that's a job. <laughs> but, but you're a homeowner, and I'm not. <laughs> Oh, see, like, I, the last time I played, I played, I think, the next to last uh, Mike Williams Picking Circle in Nashville. And uh, at that point, they knew they were moving to New York, but they hadn't told anybody except me <laughs> and a couple other people. Because uh, I just, you know, I just let myself into the house and stayed there for weeks on end. And pretty much had to <laughs> but, um, so, and, and I was thinking it might be the last time that we ever, I didn't know if he was going to do this here. And, I didn't know if he was going to love it here or hate it here. And so I did this song for them. And I'm glad that you know it's been resurrected because it's a wonderful thing. In the Mike Williams Picking Circle. Yeah. It's the matron saint. Yeah. The matron saint, the roof over the head. That's right. So now I can, can do this song for you here. It's a song I wrote uh, about a day I spent in New York with my ex-girlfriend. Oh, yeah. I call her my ex-girlfriend. She calls me that son of a bitch. <laughs> 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 we'll get to that. <laughs> Come on, go on. 